What is up, risk takers? Welcome to the Kill Pete Strategy, and welcome to Map Master Mondays Live, ladies and gentlemen. This is the second map of the U.S. Cities Map Pack. This is New York. New York, I'm spawning in the final position. We're looking at every single map in the game one by one for progressive world dom and putting them into a tier list, which is the best, which is the worst, and which is everything in between. New York, New York, world domination. Um, Auto 60 expert automated bot. We do start with one. No Fog, Blizzards, Portals, Alliances. I'm in the final position. The first position, the green player's General Savage, 19024 from an unspecified location. In the second position, the magenta player's General Musket, 11675 from the United Kingdom. In the third position, we have Arthas from Iran, playing as blue. In the fourth position, we have General Bose, 14246 from Romania, uh, playing as red. The fifth position is a yellow bot. Um... And I'm playing as orange in the final seat. I'm not on stream mode. Yeah, I don't care. I, ju I change my name every fucking day. <laughs> and I will take a look at <coughs> the bonuses on New York, New York. You got the five boroughs of Staten Island. Is a three for three. Brooklyn apparently is 12. Also is Queens. Bronx is a two for three. And Manhattan is a one, two, three, four, five for five. If you can hold it. Do I go for Manhattan? Ooh. You know, I don't hate it. Okay, blue chooses to roll a 5v2 instead of a 5v1. Immediate sus behavior. Ah. Ew, New York Cavs. Or wait, just New York? Yeah, that was not a fun game for you. <laughs> we got Becky with the good air. Hey. Uh, you want you want me to uh, give a little teaser for everyone? Uh, I didn't I didn't uh, start my stream with those clips, but uh, how do yeah you down with the teaser? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, stay tuned for the end of the show. Um, we're going to put up just a little bit of a teaser. I just wanted your permission. A little bit of a teaser from the content creators collabo at my home last weekend playing IRL Risk. Um, Becky had the genius idea setting up a confessional. Everyone can spill their guts about the betrayals and the alliances and the secret backroom dealings. And uh, it's a funny video that she's been editing. You just finished right on. So I'm stay tuned for the end of the video. We're going to play just a quick little clip of that. And there will be obviously much, much more to come. So. Do, we don't see red hit a four. So we don't see red go for the other bonus. Oh, the bot hits my three right on, man. We're down to 15. Before we start, they'll bump us up to 21, but we're in the middle. There's four if you want to just, just, just put, uh, send me something that you want me to throw up, right? Just to tease the people, whatever you want to have uh, a little, little promotional early, early access. I don't have a one to hit. Hit about two, I guess. I don't love that. No, I do have a one to hit. <coughs> okay. And we pull the Joker to start. Okay. Okay. I don't hate this. This is an all right start. So New York is a bit of a smaller map, eh? What do we got? Five, six, 11, 16, plus six is 22. Plus eight is 34. 34 territories. A bit on the small side. There's only five bonuses. The Staten Island bonus is more viable. Green's going to break. Ooh, green eviscerates magenta. Magenta goes. Okay, poor magenta. Green is crazy greedy. Hmm. Green takes the noob quarter. Yes, there is. Staten Island apparently is the noob quarter on this map. Alexander the Great. Hey, Pete. First time I've caught you live. I love your videos on YouTube. Thanks, Alexander. Thank you. So we do see Magenta take the other bonus. Two plus three is on this map. There's three for three and a two for three. Staten Island, the Bronx. Do we see blue be aggressive to that? 
Also possible we see the bot add in rule 5e3, which would suck for Magenta. Blue stays on me? No. Hmm. There's two noob corners on this map, essentially, yeah. Almost, huh? That's actually quite interesting. Two noob corners gives the, gives the noobs lots of options. I don't usually shoot uh, Map Master Mondays live, so if, if you guys in the chat have any questions or comments on the series, I know uh, Caps is currently in, this, in Ascendancy for Ranked, but, um, you know, as a prog world dom man through and through i'm i'm very happy to keep prog world dom alive on the risk youtubes and hopefully some of y'all like that as well okay so red goes for a 5v3 and fail we are seeing a very marked no bonus version bad neighbor version of these settings yeah So three noobs here. Oh, you got me, Slam. Slam calling me a noob. <laughs> I love this series, Pete. Always looking forward to your upload Monday evening when I'm back from work. Don't watch Maximizer. <laughs> don't spoil. Don't spoil. Yourself. No, I mean, hey, man, I, that's what, part of why I don't shoot it live a lot. But I figure this is just, these settings were sort of been unsnipable. Like, who the fuck would have guessed that I was going to suddenly play a New York World Dom game, right? It's highly unlikely that any of these four players are sniping the Pete-Man. Okay, so. I don't usually want to be in a single position. These two positions look good, right? I got a 10 and 11 here. Green's holding a bonus, pissed off Magenta. Magenta's holding a bonus. I mean, Magenta's down to fucking eight troops here. We got a bot too, spicing it up. Is the open chest a good strat to intimidate opponents? No, no, I'm not trying to intimidate anyone. I'm trying to distract you with the bountiful chest hair. Right, maybe you'll think favorably of me. <laughs> what exactly does it mean with someone stripes? Oh, I just can't. I can't play the Europe cap settings anymore live. That's all. Maybe I will and just accept that they're bullshit games. Um, but I, I can't take them seriously because they're such a shit show. Right, people like watching the stream and then they can see through the fog and such. Right, it's okay. I don't. Surprisingly, folks, I don't actually care about my risk rank. You might be surprised to learn. Um, it doesn't mean a ton anymore. Uh, <laughs> all right. So green has hunkered down his, his position. He has an ancillary three stack that he will move out. So green has a uh, two point um, exterior guard on Staten Island, but he's locked about 10 troops there. Green is not good. We've learned a lot about green. They really, really suck. So probably wise to keep them away from my border. Um, Magenta's probably busy being pissed at green. Blue maintaining a stack next to my 10 I really don't like. The red kill becomes viable pretty soon. The magenta kill's also viable. All I have to do is uh, I'm going to stack uh, two here, hit, stack one there, fortify. And I'll sit with like a 12 and 11 pointed at red and magenta, and I'll be able to get whichever kill matters or uh, get Wodal. Hello. There are settings people can change to figure out what games you're in. Well, you should only change maps, so it will be harder to change the turn timer. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. If I, um, the, well, think about the issues, right? I want to give the viewer the best experience. So if the viewer wants to play these settings, if the viewer wants to see videos on these settings, then it is, then I'm heavily incentivized to play them. Um, and frankly, those settings in this case are very interesting, dynamic games. So they make for good video and they're fun to play. Oh, Magenta. Oh, Magenta getting smoked by the bots. All right. They're not, not fully smokage yet, but near smokage territory. All right. One here, maybe. I'll just pivot one territory over on both of our positions. So we just rotate. We have a 10 and a 12 pointed at red and magenta, essentially. 
Hello, Pete. How are you? I'm great. I'm great, Andy Bandy. How are you? If he doesn't care about his rank, he cares about the content he makes. Well, I mean, obviously, when you're playing ranked, I'm mostly trying to play to win still. But, I mean, does my risk rank reflect my ability to play? I don't know. I've been playing this game every day for fucking three years, right? Like, I've already gotten to rank number one. I've already gotten to a bunch of accomplishments. So, like, what else is there left to prove, you know? Gonna end very soon. <laughs> yeah, we got a couple. Of, well, these these games go about, it's Prog World on. These games go about eight turns. So, we got another four. We're halfway through the game now. I like XLS. I like caps. Yes, caps is fun. People like caps a lot. Magenta didn't learn their lesson, and they're still going to be taking cards. Exterior. I guess they don't want to be in a single position. Magenta actually seems to know how to play somewhat. Uh, the kill Sharon strategy. Yes, get Sharon. Sharon must die. Uh, <laughs> yeah. We all know your all your camouflage, Marin. Kill Marin. Do I play like a novice, you think? I don't have any novice accounts at the moment, Shalem. All right, and the bot. Blue's in three positions better than mine. The red kill looks good. Take four cards on the f on 15. Is the tournament game? No, I uh, I advanced. That will be on the YouTube's. Don't think he moves down. Does move down? Okay. I gotta wait for the red kill to be good. Okay, yellow breaks 5v3? Uh huh. They do. Okay, they just get bad dice. That blue seven is actually reasonably threatened by the yellow six now. We're sitting with two 12 stacks, sitting on four cards. We have a set. Um, both Magenta and Red have caught up. Green is in an okay lead at 34, but they have a ton of locked troops, which tells us what, folks? What does this board position tell us about Green? Right? It tells us they do not play aggressive. Because one of the things you're never going to want to do in progressive world dom is lock your troops from making kills green is a gm get the fuck out of here oh so so they're are they actually <laughs> they're not tells them they're not a stream sniper yeah i don't think they're a stream sniper i mean unless they're intentionally playing bad which is possible i mean the odds i get stream sniped in this game like as i said right who the fuck would have predicted I was going to play New York World Dom? Got to keep my plus three. Exactly. I don't think Green's a chance. Slam was joking. Don't fucking. You're throwing me off, Slam. I trusted you. I trusted you. <laughs> okay. So Magenta on five cards. Don't skip. You No, 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 no. Don't you skip there. You need that fifth card. You need to trade if you're Magenta. It's the Australian Staten Island. This is not fixed. This is progressive. Yes, this is progressive, Steve. <laughs> All right, so I'm actually worried about blue the most. Blue actually seems to know what they're doing. All right, so does, does red set? Do I set kill red set? A 
bit early to snowball, but I think I can get red. So what do I got to hit? 18 for five cards. So I'm going to take the six, seven, eight, nine, plus eight. Yeah, it's worth. It's worth. I mean, the bot's a one troop better kill, but I'd rather have the bot. The bot probably sets here. No, bot's going to sit on five cards. Can I get the bot kill as well? That spicy. Okay. Can't really get the bot in a straight line. Uh... I think set kill red set is a perfectly viable play, and I don't lose my joker, at least not in the first move. So. Magenta gives me a well played. I said without losing the Joker here, which I like. Now let's see how this cookie crumbles. Because green being locked is just fatal. They can't actually meaningfully impact the board. So they're just stuck in their corner. It's too early to sweep, unfortunately. The sets were too low, right? I got the six and the eight. If 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 that was a one turn leader, I could sweep from there. But it's it was um, it was slightly too early. But I have a guaranteed trade, and if Magenta does, and Magenta skipped last turn, so there's no reason they don't skip again. I have the I have the kill on Magenta. Looks like they fucked this up. Maybe Blue gets Magenta before I do. Also, the Yellow Bot's going to be a factor, but the Yellow Bot probably hits not me. He's going to pull more troops into themselves, into their own locked pocket. Congratulations, Grain. You hide in your hole, sir. <laughs> Go hide it. Yes, Green. Okay, the, actually, the 14 is open in the bottom line into, into yellow. Um, but Green could have meaningfully impacted. Okay, Magenta takes a fifth card here. So, unless Blue kills them, I, I pretty much win this game. Set, kill Magenta set again. He must lock troops. <laughs> yeah, what a goof. Goofball. All right, so uh, blue is going to get the 10. Um, yellow gets the 12. I get the 15 and then kill Magenta and get the 20. Unless blue takes the Magenta kill first, which I don't think he does. I think he fails. He goes for this kill. He fails it. Yeah, he doesn't go for it. Okay, cool. Good, good, good. And then the bot takes the 12. Rolls 12v7 in the corner. Gotta make sure this bot doesn't actually block my path. 12v7 in the corner. Yep. That's game, folks. That's pretty much game. I kill, kill magenta set, kill bot set. Gives me a so lucky. Magenta had a Joker. Why didn't you trade it if you had a Joker, bro? Okay. Am I going to kill one of these guys after the fact? Hmm. Do 
Do I have the juice to kill blue? Mm. Here's the problem. It's not 100% kill, but I probably should just grow some balls and go for it, right? Yeah, slider error. And we grew the balls, folks. <laughs> All right, we're going to keep blues. We're going to keep greens 23 stack locked. We're not going to force trade our joker. And Bob is, as always, your uncle. <laughs> Balls acquired. <laughs> Damn, today we are lucky. Yeah, it all went my way, didn't it? <laughs> so lucky, yes. <laughs> Sometimes it all works out for the Piedmont. Good game, sir. Good game, good game. Yeah. Start spreading the news. You shouldn't lock your troops. Especially not in Staten Island. Uh, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. And there you have it. Where do we think New York stacks up in the tier list for Progressive World Bomb? Let's bring up the tier list, shall we? Well, first, let's see the ranks. Was anyone good this game? I don't think there was a single player above intermediate. Oh, incorrect. There are two players. Okay, there wasn't a single player above intermediate, but there were two intermediates this game. Green is an intermediate. Magenta is an intermediate. They hit each other early. And then two beginners who got smoked. We do have double, double. <laughs> I am sharing that Wong Mom, but good one. Mama made a dick joke, folks. Ha <laughs> ha. Immortalized forever on the YouTubes. Sharing that Wong, folks. All right. Um, ladies and gentlemen, we got New York, New York. Where do you think New York stacks up in the tier list for Progressive World Dom? Um, do I like it? First of all, do I like it more than classic frozen? No. Do I like it more than Roman empire? Yes. I actually think that's where it belongs. I think it's a bad map. Fundamentally. It's small. Um, but it does have two noob corners, which makes it very, very interesting. Doesn't it? So I think that's where we're putting it on the tier list. What do you guys agree with? What do you guys disagree with? Um, and as promised, a little sneak peek from the Risk Content Creators Labo. How do I? Hold on. Download and. Lovely. I'm sure you're all very like, okay. I would like to confess one thing. Yeah. Now that I've met Mallory, she's even cooler than I thought she was going to be. Please don't suicide into me. I love I know her. you get very angry. Okay. Okay. Who are we teaming on? I think we should team on Becky. No. Never. Guilty. She's listening. I'm right here. <laughs> hey, I'm Mallory and this is my favorite recipe. Mm. It's getting hot. Oh my god. Oh, frick. Oh, it's getting so hot. Man, frick. He tricked me. He tricked me. You guys, he tricked me. I'm doing my best. He told me to attach a didge. I attacked a didge. I'm gonna die. Pete. Pete tricked me. He tricked. Tricked. Pig. A few moments later.
confession, Kilted is trying to give the win to Digitalic, which I find to be extremely sexist. Kilted hates women. You heard it here first. Oh, okay. Oh, frick. You guys want to know how you can kiss a girl? Moonman. I haven't decided yet. I think we're going to break Pete on the moon. Mr. Moonman. Okay, so I'm attacking JJ quite a bit. I'm rolling a lot of ones. I rolled triple ones multiple times. We've only played four turns so far. JJ and Oliver are almost dead. I've lost a lot of dice attacking. I have four cards. So I have two cavalry and two artillery, so I don't like risk. I don't like it anymore. Twelve seconds later. You take her by the jaw like this. All right. You take her by the jaw and you just go like this. You bite into her like an apple. Mm. I thought you kissed a girl. Frick. I want to make my wife so happy. Um, if you're hearing this, wife, please, this never, it never happened. Thanks to the camera. Come closer. Okay, but me too. We, me we, too. We have to <laughs> top <laughs> three. <laughs> top two. We have a top three. One, two, three, right here. Okay, so I hit Olive. I die. I killed Olive. Yeah, that's right. Kills against stuff my dick. <laughs>